Hey, in this video, I just wanted to give you some tips on how to switch between gear sets faster without fumbling around. This is gonna be a quick one, so buckle up. Tip number one. If you're switching between three styles, have a gear piece for every style you want to switch to. In this example, I make sure I have three weapons, three capes, three gloves, three body armors, three amulets and three leg pieces. I kind of only wanted to bring the Barrow's Gloves for melee and ranged and the Tormented Bracelet for magic, but that would mess up my inventory when doing my switches, so I added the extra Ferocious Glove Switch to have a glove switch for every attack style. Tip number 2. Use the Runelite Inventory Tags plugin to mark your gear pieces. I choose to color my melee gear red, my ranged gear green and my magic gear blue. Just shift plus right click to color an item. I know this may look quite unappealing, but it does really help out a ton. Tip number 3. Take the shortest path to complete the gear switch. I like to keep my gear in columns of 2 and make an S shape movement. This gives you some horizontal mouse movement, which is easier on the hands. What you don't want to do is equip the first column of 3 pieces and then move your mouse all the way up to start equipping your next 3 pieces. Tip number 4. Enable the Runelight Anti-Drag plugin. This will make it less likely for you to drag an item to another spot. I like to set the delay to around 10 so I can still quickly move my potions around and whatnot. Tweak this number to your personal preference. Tip number 5 is gonna be practicing. It's best to try this for a while while standing at the bank so you don't have the added stress of a boss slapping you around. Start with fewer switches and work your way up until it feels comfortable. If you want to get some more experience with switches, with the added pressure of actually killing something, I'd recommend you go try out fighting the demonic gorillas or Zulra, as you'll need to do a lot of switching at those places. And the final tip, for the love of god, use F keys. I set my combat options to F1, my inventory to F2, my prayers to F3 and my spellbook to F4. That way you have all the important panels available at the touch of a button if you need to switch prayers, want to change your attack styles or want to cast a spell. You can change which F key corresponds to which panel by going to the control sections in the settings menu. And that's pretty much it. I hope I was able to help you get those faster switches. It's especially useful in the tombs of a mascot. Thanks for watching. See ya.